I am an international master student. I was used to go nearly every day at the UNSW library. So I had clear boundaries between my personal life and my studying. So I really set up targets and I decide which class I want to study when to continue um, being organized and to make the most of the day and stay really efficient, which can be a challenge in those times. I'd say I'm managing the transition better by working out a schedule and spreading out my workload throughout the week. In terms of completing assignments and exams, I can focus like more of my time on that rather than say sit in lecture halls and not listening to anything because I'm busy stressing about another subject. Was that I found certain things actually were better on online context and certain things were worse in online context. It, it's it's happening. It's getting better. I think everyone, both students and teachers, are getting better every day. So you know, modulate what would normally happen in a classroom into you know something which happens on Zoom. As an art student, and I'm mainly doing like arts this trimester, it's been remarkably easy um, because it's the same lecture format and the same um, like assessment formats. It's just essays, so nothing's really changed. Um, but I think the biggest thing you miss is like the tutor conversations with peers and your tutors and just discussing the assessments or like the content of the week. You know, I think the two main challenges that students face is first not having that same kind of human engagement with lecturers and tutors and also just being distracted by all your electronics and YouTube and things like this. So I think the way how I've come, uh, how I've kind of overcome it is by first just emailing more and being a bit more proactive in my learning.